Welcome to Smart Notebook Math Tools. In this session, we will learn how to use the GeoDrag. If you click on the measurement tools icon in the secondary toolbar, you will see displayed the icons for the ruler, the protractor, the GeoDrag, and the compass. By selecting the third icon, you will see displayed a GeoDrag, which is a combination of a ruler, protractor, and set squares. It's also in the shape of an isosceles triangle. As we hold the middle portion, we can move the geodrag to anywhere on the workspace. By holding the middle set of numbers, we can resize the geodrag by pulling in and out. Holding outside of the numbers, we can rotate the geodrag. And as we rotate around, you see the angle of rotation displayed which notice that it remains vertical so that you can read the measurements easily. You can create drawings by drawing, by tracing along the edge with a marker pen, holding it at the edge. You can draw straight lines as we trace the edge. Now let's see some of these functions as applied to an example. So first of all, from the secondary toolbar, selecting the measurement tools icon, selecting your third icon for a geodrag, holding the middle space and dragging geodrag onto the workspace. We can now draw an isosceles triangle by tracing along the edge using a marker pen. We can trace along the edge to create the sides of a triangle. and create all the side lengths. And then we can, as I complete the triangle shape, now dragging the geodrag to one of the vertices, I can measure our angle. So first of all, we see it lines up on the edge as a 45 degree angle. And as I rotate it around, we can have displayed the angle measure 45 degrees. Now, if I wanted to bisect that angle, I could rotate back down to about 20, two and a half, 23. So we can draw along the edge. And as I draw along the edge, note that I can go right past my geodrag and still have a straight line to show the angle bisector at 23 degrees. In our next session, we'll learn how to create arcs and some of its functions.